here, and this is Let's Build It, the game where we're engineers who plan and build stuff for our friends. Let's go! Well, hi there! We need to build a castle that's big enough for Big Bird to stand in. First, let's measure to find out how tall it needs to be. Measure Big Bird from the bottom of his orange feet. Move that up to the top of Big Bird's Let's Count Together. Big Bird is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks tall. Great job! You got it. Terrific measuring. <laughs> We know how tall the castle needs to be. Now let's measure to find out how wide it needs to be. Measure Big Bird from one side. Move that up. Let's count together. Big Bird is one, two, three, four blocks wide. Yippee! <laughs> Great measuring! I am using all those measurements to make a blueprint, which is a drawing. That we can use as a guide to build the castle. Let's start planning with shapes. Click on a shape. That's a rectangle. It has. That's a triangle. It has. That's a square. It has four rectangle. Great job, square! You did it. You fit the shapes together to plan our castle. Now it's time to choose a material to build with. Choose one of these materials: soft, fluffy feathers, strong, smooth wood, heavy, sturdy stone. Wood. Let's investigate building with wood. Good thinking. Wood is a strong material for building. You're an excellent engineer. You help plan and build a castle big enough for Big Bird. Yippee! <laughs> Thank you for your help. Alrighty, let's build something else. Come on! Oh, hi there. Alrighty, we need to build a castle that's big enough for Snuffy to stand in. First, let's measure to find out how tall it needs to be. Measure Snuffy from the bottom of his feet. Move that up to the top of. Sn Let's count together. Snuffy is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven blocks tall. Oh, wow! Terrific measuring. <laughs> We know how tall the castle needs to be. Now let's measure to find out how wide it needs to be. Measure Snuffy from one side to the other. Click on the measuring tape. Move the. Let's count together. Snuffy is one, two, three, four, five blocks wide. Nice work. <laughs> Great measuring. I am using all those measurements to make a blueprint. Let's start planning with shapes. Click on a shape to pick it up. That's a triangle. It has a triangle. That's a rectangle. It has a triangle. 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 Move that to the blueprint. And if we put that shape there, then some of the triangle, triangle, triangle. Good work, triangle, triangle.
If we put that chain triangle, that's a great plan. Rectangle, triangle, triangle. to build with. Choose one of these materials. Let's investigate building with stone. Super choice. Stone is a strong material to build with. You're an excellent engineer. You help plan and build a castle big enough for Snuffy. That is just beautiful. I think there's more to build. Let's go see. Hello. Hi there. Okay, we need to build a castle that's big enough for both Big Bird and Snuffy to stand in together. First, let's measure to find out how tall it needs to be. Big Bird is taller than Snuffy. Move that up. Let's count together. Big Bird is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks tall. Terrific. Cool. Terrific measuring. <laughs> we know how tall the castle needs to be. Now let's measure to find out how wide it needs to be. Measure Big Bird and Snuffy together. Move that over to the Let's Count Together. Standing side by side, Big Bird and Snuffy are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine blocks wide. Great job. Oh, gee. Great measuring. I am using all those measurements to make a blueprint. Let's start planning with shapes. Click on a shape. That's a pentagon. That's an oval. It's oval. Pentagon. If we put that shape pentagon, move that to the blueprint. <laughs> you really know your shapes. Hmm. That's pentagon. doesn't go there. Move the shape around until you see a spot where Pentagon. Oval. Oval. Great job. Hmm. That's Pentagon. That's a rectangle. 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 Good work. That's a square. It has square. Pentagon. That's a great plan. Pentagon. Move that to the blueprint 
and click on a spot with the same shape of oval. Let's count 
together. The canopy is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine blocks high. Great job! Yippee! You measured the height. We know how tall the rocket ship can be, but I wonder how long to make it. Let's see. It can be as long as the blue mat. Let's measure to find out how long that is. Measure from one edge of the blue mat to the other edge. Move that over to. Let's count together. The blue mat is one, two, three, four, five, six blocks wide. You did it! Yes, you measured the length. I am using all those measurements to make a blueprint. Let's start planning with shapes. Click on a shape to pick it up. That's a triangle. It has three sides. Triangle. Triangle. That's a square. It has four. That's a rectangle. It has a rectangle. Wonderful. You made a plan for a playground rocket ship using shapes. Now it's time to choose a material to build with. Choose one of these materials. Let's investigate building with plastic. Nice solution. Plastic is strong and easy to build with. Way to go! Just like an engineer, you help plan and build a playground rocket ship for Elmo. Yay! We did it together. Thank you for your help. You're a super engineer. Let's build together some more. Hi there. Elmo wants to play on a playground pirate ship. It can be as tall as the purple canopy. Let's measure to find out how tall that is. Measure from the ground to the canopy. Click on the measuring tape. Move that up to the. Let's count together. The canopy is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks high. Great job! Yippee! You measured the height. We know how tall the pirate ship can be, but I wonder how long to make it. Let's see. It can be as long as the blue mat. Let's measure to find out how long that is. Measure from one edge of the blue mat to the other. Move that over to the other edge. Of Let's count together. The blue mat is one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten blocks wide. You did it! Yes, you measured the length. I am using all those measurements to make a blueprint. Let's start planning with shapes. Click on a shape to pick it up. That's a triangle. It has three sides and three angles. Triangle. That's a square. It has four. That's a rectangle. It's square. Rectangle. Wow! You use different shapes to plan a neat playground pirate ship. Now it's time to choose a material to build with. Choose one of these materials. Plastic. Pla Let's investigate building with plastic. Nice solution. Plastic is strong and easy to build with. Way to go! Just like an engineer, you help plan and build a playground pirate ship for Elmo. Yay! We did it together. Thank you for your help. I wonder who else needs our help. Let's find out. 
cute little Tommy Twiddlebug needs a bridge to get across the yucky puddle. I wonder how long the bridge needs to be. Let's measure to find out. Measure from one edge of the yucky puddle. Move that. Let's count together. The yucky puddle is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks long. Hooray! Fantastic measuring! <laughs> I am using all those measurements to make a blueprint, which is a drawing that we can use as a guide to build a bridge. Let's start planning with shapes. Click on a shape to pick it up. That's a rhombus. That's a triangle. It has three sides and three angles. Rhombus. Triangle. Rhombus. Good for you. You planned a bridge using shapes. Now it's time to choose a material to build with. Choose one of these materials. Light, soft leaves. Strong, smooth wood. Heavy, sturdy stone. Wood. Let's investigate building with wood. Good thinking. Wood is a strong material for building. You're a fabulous engineer. You help plan and build a bridge to get the twiddle bug across the yucky puddle. Hooray! Thank you for your help. Okay, let's see what else needs building. Come on! Cute little Tommy Twiddlebug needs a bridge to get across the yucky puddle and over the flower. First, I wonder how long the bridge needs to be. Let's measure to find out. Measure from one edge of the yucky puddle. Move that over. Let's count together. The yucky puddle is one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine blocks long. Hooray! Fantastic measuring! <laughs> we know how long the bridge needs to be. I wonder how tall it needs to be to go over the flower. Let's measure to find out. Measure from the top of the yucky puddle to the top of the flower. Click on the measuring tape. Move, let's count together. The flower is one, two, three, four blocks tall. Hooray! Awesome measuring. <laughs> I am using all those measurements to make a blueprint. Let's start planning with shapes. Click on a shape. That's an octagon. Octagon. Octagon! Octagon! That's a rectangle. That's a triangle. It has triangle. Rectangle. Rectangle. Good for you. You planned a bridge using shapes. Now it's time to choose a material to build with. Choose one of these materials. Leaves. Wood. Stone. Wood. wood. Let's investigate building with wood. Good thinking. Wood is a strong material for building. You're a fabulous engineer. You help plan and build a bridge to get the twiddle bug across the yucky puddle and over the flower. Hooray! Thank you for your help. I just love engineering. <laughs> Let's build some more. Cute little Tommy Twiddlebug needs a bridge to get across the yucky puddle. A 
hand over the rock. First, I wonder how long the bridge needs to be. Let's measure to find out. Measure from one edge of the... Move that over. Let's count together. The yucky puddle is... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve blocks long. Hooray! Fantastic measuring! <laughs> we know how long the bridge needs to be. I wonder how tall it needs to be to go over the rock. Let's measure to find out. Measure from the top of the yucky puddle to move. Let's count together. The rock is one, two, three, four blocks tall. Hooray! Awesome measuring. <laughs> I am using all those measurements to make a blueprint. Let's start planning with shapes. Click on a shape to pick. That's a hexagon. It's hexagon. Hexagon. Nice. Play hexagon. That's a rectangle. It has four sides. Two are short and two are long. Rectangle. Rectangle. That's a triangle. It has three sides and three angles. Rectangle. 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 Good for you. You planned a bridge using shapes. Now it's time to choose a material to build with. Choose one of these materials. St Let's investigate building with stone. Super choice. Stone is a strong material to build with. You're a fabulous engineer. You help plan and build a bridge to get the twiddle bug across the yucky puddle and over the rock. Hooray! Thank you for your help! 